kind of checked a couple boxes on that today. Uh, next up, we're going to be talking about user experience. This is really important for people who are using uh, OpenStack, both operators and app developers and end users of OpenStack clouds. And one of the people who's providing a lot of leadership in that area is the PTL for OpenStack client. And he's also a senior cloud engineer at Intel. So let's welcome out Dean Troyer. <laughs> All right, Dean. So a lot of people may know what OpenStack Client is, but not everybody. So let's start with that. What is OpenStack Client? OpenStack Client is a re-implementation of the core command line clients for the OpenStack projects. We started four years ago, and with, uh, I guess there's five now that we cover internally. OK, so before we had a bunch of individual clients for all the pieces of OpenStack. Now we're bringing it together in a unified way. and. When you talk about them being unified or consistent, like why does that matter to people? Why do they want a consistent experience with that? Users should not have to know that volumes are handled by Cinder, that flavors, server flavors are handled by Nova. It should be one experience. And getting rid of that and making all of the commands have a consistent form mm -hmm. and just feel the same um, takes a whole layer of stuff that a user doesn't have to think about, it takes it away. Cool. So you said about five projects are covered today. So what which projects are you are you covering with the project right now? We do um, compute, image, identity, volume, and network. And those are all those all come in the box. Okay. So I imagine uh, with OpenStack having having some other capabilities out there, there are probably people asking you for more. So how do we grow it beyond that set? What we did to keep it manageable and to keep from a user from having to install every client, we've got plugins now to handle um, the additional projects that have come along, especially with the big tent. Uh, we've seen an explosion in the number of projects and the number of things that want to have a similar CLI experience. So you can just install, if you need heat, you install the heat client and OSC will automatically use it. Cool. So I, I guess just a quick show of hands, who here wants to see OpenStack user experience continue to improve? Is that, is that important to people? All right, I just put the lighting team on an on a <laughs> unexpected uh, quiz there in the back. Um, cool, so if people here want to see it improve, you know, that, that's the good news. The bad news is you're now all going to work on it. So all those people, they want to get involved to help you. How can they get involved? Well, there's a couple of things. We are, we are actually in a perpetual catch-up mode with okay. the projects, trying to keep up with the new things that they implement and with the new projects. So the things to do are to just help implement those things and come find us. We've got a session on Thursday and we've got, more importantly, a meetup session on Friday afternoon where we're going to be talking about this kind of thing and it's more informal and we're on IRC. We hang out in the OpenStack SDK. SDK's IRC channel. Uh, okay. You can also find us that way, if away from the Design Summit. Good. And I guess uh, we've got some new mobile apps this time, so you can search on your mobile app and, and look for Dean Troyer's sessions, and uh, you know help pitch in, and that's that's how we make it better. So thanks so much, Dean. Thanks for having me, Mark. <laughs> Thank you.